Hello and welcome to my.homecampus.com.sg. Let's solve another problem on number patterns. It says, what are the next three numbers in the number pattern below? And the numbers given to us are 3,854, 3,864, 3,874, and then three missing numbers. Well, just by saying these numbers out loud, you can make out that there's a difference of 10 from uh, in going from one number to the next. But still, we'll use our place value chart just to make sure that that's the rule. All right, so we have the place value chart here and we fill in the first number, which is 3,854, and the second number, which is 3,864. Now we see that between the ones, there is no difference between the tens, there's a difference of one. Okay, so going from the first number to the second number, the tens changes by one. Okay. All right, now the hundreds, there's no difference there, and the thousands also, there's no difference there. So there you go. In going from the first number to the second number, there's a difference of 10. So you add 10 to the first number to get the second number. Okay, now how about the third number? Well, the third number is 3,874. There's no difference in the ones. There's a difference of one in the tens, no difference in the hundreds, and no difference in the thousands. So there you go. Our rule is, again, still the same, which is add 10 to the second number to get the third number. So our rule is add 10 to get the next number. Simple? So let's do that. Let's find out the first missing number. All right, we add 10 to the previous number. So no difference in the ones. There's a change in the tens place by one. Okay, there is no change in the hundreds place and there's no change in the thousands place. So the first missing number is 3,884. Similarly, to get the next missing number, we add 10 again and we get 3,894. All right. Now, lastly, the last missing number. So we add 10 to the previous number. So no difference in the ones place digit. So the four is still four. In the tens place, we add one to the previous number. Okay, so nine becomes 10. Now we can't put 10 here in the tens place, right? We can only put one digit. So we put the zero here and we carry over the one to the hundreds place. And then we add the carried over one to the eight in the hundreds place and we get a nine okay and the thousands place digit doesn't change so it's still three so although there is no change in the hundreds place because we carried over the one from the tens the eight became nine that's how we do addition right if we add 10 to 894 we get 904 all right so the last missing number is 3904 all right that brings us to the end of this lesson for more such questions and practice and worksheets please visit my.homecampus.com.sg this is m signing off for now bye bye